School buses are starting to hit the streets in central Iowa for the first time in months, and it's come with a word of warning from the Iowa State Patrol. KCCI's Marcus McIntosh shows us video of how some close calls nearly became tragedies. School buses will start rolling once again, taking students to school. Now, the Iowa State Patrol is asking motorists when they see a school bus, be prepared to stop. Because the Iowa State Patrol has seen too much of this dangerously close calls. Vehicles driving right through the bus stop signs, even with parents standing along the side of the road with their children. A lot of that is attributed to people being distracted when they're driving. They're looking at a phone. Lieutenant Nathan Ludwig of the Iowa State Patrol tells us bus citations are increasing. He says from August 15th, 2017 to March 1st, 2018, they issued 45 school bus violations. The same period of time, 2019 to 2020, they issued 94, doubling the number of citations. He says scenes like this can no longer play out on Iowa's roads because they are fatalities waiting to happen. We just want to get the word out for people that they, they're going to see buses on the roads. Lieutenant Ludwig says the law is simple. If you're following a bus and see the amber lights come out, you can't pass that bus. When approaching a bus on a non-divided road or street and the amber lights come on, you must slow your speed to less than 25 miles an hour and be prepared to stop. He says what troopers hear far too often from drivers is, I didn't know. Lieutenant Ludwig has had enough of that. Absolutely no excuse because you got to imagine, like I said, they, they got to be doing something in the car that's distracting them from seeing a big, huge yellow bus with flashing lights. Um, you can't miss it. The penalty for a school bus violation is a minimum $345 fine, a non-scheduled court appearance, and could result in the loss of your license. In Des Moines, Marcus McIntosh, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.